Hi everyone. So, in case you have not been watching, this is part three of what I got for Christmas. So, if you want to see the other two parts, go back and watch those now. I'm just going to keep on keeping on with what I am showing you. So, the next thing I got is... Oh, I hope it's not inside out. I got this shirt which just looks like a plain gray shirt. It's really soft, but on the back, it does this. So it's kind of baggy. It's a little big, but it's meant to be um, because it has like a layered look. So I got that. I also got this bag. My sister tells me it was not expensive at all which I'm glad about. Um, she has a bag that looks just like this one, which I've admired many times when I've gone home to visit. And they are not the same bag, but she got me one very similar. So um, I think this Christmas the theme was all about organization for me. So I've gotten um, something I showed in the other video to organize my makeup and things in my purse. And then I got a new purse. So it looks like this, kind of like a bowling bag, um, and it folds down like that. It's got these nice gold handles, and then it's got this strap, gold strap, which you can take on you can leave on or take off, so you can carry the bag this way, or how I like to do it, which is like this. Then on the bottom, it has this nice textured fabric, and you can also zip up the bottom all the way around to make it smaller. So, um, looks like that on the back. On the front, it's got a pocket here things. It also has a pocket here. Then you open it and the inside looks like that. And it's got some pockets that you probably can't see here and here. And then a nice big pocket in here. So I'm very excited about that because I desperately need some uh, a new bag. I'm not going to show you what else is in this box. This is just clothes, um, and you're probably not going to be able to see them from me holding it up, but I'll tell you what else is in there. There is a um, jacket, or I guess sweater, to go over a shimmery black tank top, just a basic black tank top that I got. Um, the jacket has sort of, not tassels, but like, strings that hang off of it, if that makes sense, and it kind of reminds me of a western type of a coat, and that's for my mom, and then I got a really nice cardigan that has a black and white floral print, so that's what's in there. <coughs> um, no, we'll get to that, we'll get to that. Okay, the next thing... This is a Grinch Pajamas onesie. I ordered one for myself, and I ordered one for my sister. And I gave them to gave her hers the night before Christmas, um, and we wore them on Christmas Day. So I'll try to show you. So these are the feet, and then it's quite long. It's very soft. It's very long. But when you, uh, so mine, I got this on Target.com. It zips up like a jumpsuit. The top of it looks like this. Mine is in the size extra large. These are actually juniors sizes, so I figured to be safe, I should get an extra large. And then the arms look like that, so, um, my sister and I both wore these on Christmas, it was really funny. 
only at my house, though, not at my grandparents' house. Then my mom got me these, which I think is probably random. It's uh, the little plastic containers, like the sauces or ranch dressing or whatever, come in. And this is very useful for me for many reasons. I can put earrings, <laughs> of all things, I can put earrings in here to transport them. And I can take them to work because I have a little sauce container thing that I take to work, but you have to wash it every time, and I don't have a dishwasher, so these will be nice for that purpose. <clears throat> totally randomly, I have a dish towel by the Food Network that came with a gift that someone I work with gave me, which I will probably have to show you in another video. But it's over there. I do doubt you can see it. It's in that green box. So that's that. It's actually quite big. Okay. This is just the package that my computer decal came in. You guys see that? Got a magazine here with Ron Burgundy on it that my mom saved for me. She gives me a lot of her old magazines. Then I've got <coughs> my sister gave me this. It's by a company called Prepara, or Prepara, whatever you want to call it, dot com. And it is a Chef Center cookbook holder, or uh, the way that they recommend using it, like you can put an iPad in there, so I'm not going to open it. But I got my sister one for her birthday, because she's in nursing school, and they use iPads in nursing school and she could cook with it and not get food on the screen so this little piece here comes out you can adjust it to lean back I think it goes back like two more spaces so if you have something really thick like a cookbook I think it can fit things up to like this wide inside so you can adjust it for to be thin like for an iPad or thick for a book or whatever so it's basically a stand, and then the, this part comes out, it lays down in here for storage, and then the plastic part also lays down for storage, and then it has a little pull-out thing that's got um, <clears throat> information for weight measurement conversions. So the whole thing folds up flat uh, to be stored. So I got my sister one for her birthday. And she swears to me this isn't the same one that I bought her. Because I was a little suspicious at first that she was giving it back. But uh, she says it's not. So I'm very excited about that because I've really wanted one. So she got me that. <clears throat> her mom got me a nice... Um, I think this is a bread knife? Let me look. I think this is a bread knife. Uh, yeah. But it's by Wusthof. Um, if you know anything about knives, Wusthof's pretty, pretty good brand. And, yeah. It's got this, like, scalloped edge on it. And this can add to my collection, because I've got some other Wusthof knives also. So that was nice. The cat is very curious what's going on. Then I've got, to go with it, a <coughs> wall rack, or a wall hanging magnetic strip for knives, which unfortunately, this is really nice, but I hope I can hang it at my apartment. I think I'm going to do it anyway, and then repair the holes or something when I move. Hopefully I won't get in trouble. Mm -hmm. 
this. Gosh, this is gonna make so much noise. Oh. Cut. Another magazine. Basically, all that's left in that bag is some of my mom's magazines she gave me. This is probably my favorite thing. In. I'm not sure where this company is from. I've never heard of it before, but they're the same company that my mom got me the case to organize makeup in my bag, or my purse that I showed you before, except this one has a handle. It's about the size of a giant lunchbox. There's nice fabric inside, but it's protected by plastic. And if you know me, this is very exciting to me because my favorite things are makeup um, and so in Monroe. I mean, mainly just makeup. So you unzip it. Da 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 da. It's got this huge inside pocket to store makeup and things for traveling and then it's got all these nice little cases so we've got a case like this to put things in there's a little case a little circular case the possibilities are endless. So you can, this one I imagine I would use for brushes, but it's also got little bands around the inside which are elastic to hold things to the inside. So I imagine I would use it to put eyeshadows around the lining and then in the inside put, the, put makeup brushes. So there's three of those long cases and then the back of it just looks like this. And I really like how it's vinyl, plastic, whatever, so you can wash or rub it with, clean it out if powder gets inside. This type of gift for me is probably the most amazing gift you could give me because as it is now, I own way too much makeup. It's a sickness I have. But um, in the last couple years, I've been asked more and more to do makeup for friends and things, and recently, in the last few months, I was asked to do makeup for someone for their wedding, so we've been practicing that, and this will be a good alternative to having to carry my entire uh, train case that I have from Sephora, because it's very heavy, and also I don't need all the makeup that's inside. So, something like this would be great. Traveling, you could fit probably hairspray or your straightener or whatever else you want in here and you don't have to necessarily use it for makeup. So I think this is great. Great, great, great. Very happy about that. So this is probably my favorite thing that I got. Um, but that is about all I have time to show you guys right now. I'm going to run out of time yet again. I might make a final video to show you just some of the tiny little knickknacks I got. Um, from work, so maybe you'll be interested in that, but I uh, hope you guys are having a great break, a great holiday, whatever, and thank you for watching.